Hello everyone, my name is Jerry BR and welcome to Final Fantasy 2. So, we are picking up after playing the first game a couple months ago, moving into the second one, because um, I want to get work my way through them before the second part of Final Fantasy 7 Remake comes out. So... Oh yeah, it just started raining and thundering here, so hopefully my power stays on and it's not too loud that it messes up the video. I'm supposed to be getting tornadoes watch or warning right now? I don't know. Tornado watch. Emperor of Palmasia has called forth monsters has begun his campaign for world conquest. A rebel army arose in the kingdom. But the rebel's castle fell to an all-out assault by the Empire. Left with little choice, the rebels withdrew to the remote town of Altair. Four youths from Finn also found themselves fleeing the Imperial forces. They had lost their parents at the hands of the Empire, but their escape wasn't over. Alright. Oh, you can see that mouse, that's weird. Alright. Yeah, I have no magic, so just literally attack the first person. Oh. That's hilarious. Thanks, game. Will he live? He will. I sense a strong life force within him. He should regain consciousness soon. We found them like this on the escape from Finn, fallen from terrible wounds. By the time we brought them here, I feared it was already too late. His life is not in danger. The sigil will strengthen his life force. We should let him rest now. Of course. We'd best be off to the meeting. I imagine they're already waiting for us. If the Empire is allowed to complete the Dreadnought, they're building in Bafsk. Their attack will begin in earnest. We cannot sit idly by and watch. We must act. Is that the princess? Or leader of the rebels, I guess. Is this Star Wars? Where am I? Leon! Maria! Guy! Where are you? Alright. Alright, so this is Maria. Firion, you're alive. I, I thought I thought you'd I'm fine, Maria. You seem all right too, guy. But wait, where's Leon? Princess of Finn saved us. But Leon not here. I see. Don't worry. I'm sure he's okay. Alright. I don't think my characters talked in the first game. So, you've regained your strength. Very good. Your life force is strong indeed. It was you who saved us, wasn't it? Thank you. Uh, forgive me, your highness, but there is something I must ask of you. Please let us to join the rebel army. I could never allow such a thing. You know nothing of battle. You would only be throwing your lives away. You should return to your homes. But we have no homes. Not anymore. The Imperials attacked. Our parents. Our parents. I am truly sorry. But that changes nothing. I cannot permit you to join our army. If you have nowhere else to go, you're welcome to stay here in Altair. If you know our password, you should be able to live here well enough. Password is Wild Rose. Remember it well. 
Uh, learn. Learn Wild Rose. Alright, now ask about Wild Rose. The Wild Rose is the insignia of the Kingdom of Thin. It represents our hope for a flourishing future of strength and beauty. But what will become of Thin now? I've heard that the Emperor Empire's captives suffer there in confinement, even as we speak. Maria, your brother Leon is missing, is he not? It's possible that he's being held in Finn as well. But Finn is far too dangerous to travel to now. The Emperor's beasts still stalk the streets. Gaining entrance to the city will not be easy. The man at my right is Minmu Wu, the white wizard who tended your wounds. Speak with him before you leave. He may be of some assistance. Uh, alright, no key. Alright. Um, I think I can figure this out. Interesting. I see your destiny clearly. The future it holds seems closely entwined with my own. You will begin by journeying to Finn, first step towards realizing your fate. Haha, <laughs> you've wasted no time using the password. Heed well the information we can bring you. You may learn much of value by listening. I offer you one more bit of advice before you depart. Those who have fallen in battle can be revived their sanctuary. Should one of you fall before you reach the fin, go without hesitation to the nearest sanctuary. And when I get there, scream sanctuary. Is there a run button? Press and hold backspace, that's weird. Alright, but we are off. And I will take this. I will take that potion. Alright, we are in a town. I don't think this is... I'm assuming I have no money. Oh, I have 400 money. 400 gil, to be exact. Um, yeah. Oh, wait. We have broadswords. And... No, we. I have one broadsword. Okay, so they do have... We all have weapons. Alright, then I'm not gonna... I wonder if I can give people any weapons or arm... Like if they've done away with the... Classes. Alright, so I could take something from my head, arms... Oh wait, uh, I'm an idiot. I thought that was how many they had on stock. I guess I could have sold it. Well, we'll get another guy. Well, he might have. Because here's the only place where I can save the over map for some reason. Alright, so we fight some bees. Just hit, it with, hit the first one with three straight attacks. Okay.
he lives auto. Egg eaters. Oh, I guess they are kind of like they look like thorn bushes or something. I need to explore around town, right? Is that what... Is that what I'm supposed to be doing? Is I supposed to find lodging or something? Oh wait. I didn't realize I could walk through trees like this. Nice. Oh, nice. It's a different art style for being right on the bridge. I keep thinking spacebar would be run, but it continues to not be. Let's do another save. Just... Oh, is this our house? Oh no, we're in like another town. Wow. It did not make me think of the town. Two guild to heal. I think so. But only because I don't know how much damage I've taken. Um. Oh, this is an item shop. Imperial forces are occupying Castle Finn. The gates are drawn and no one can enter. If Imperial troops and monsters roaming the streets, the city isn't any better off. Gatria and Altair haven't fallen under the clutches of the Empire yet. But once the Dreadnought is complete, nothing will be able to stop the Empire. There's a pub just on the outskirts of Finn. When the Empire invaded, the barkeep didn't make it out in time. They say he's still working there, pouring drinks for the Imperials. Well, that sounds like someone that needs our help. If I've ever heard of someone who needs our help. Alright. I don't know how it figures out if we get experience to our weapons or not. Cause like, okay, Maria's went up a good chunk in that one fight. Again, I guess I'm just roaming around until I find something. But see then, Furion leveled up. Okay, everyone leveled up. Wait, so if those are the only two friendly towns, then any other town I find is going to be controlled by the Empire, right? Oh, I don't like the looks of this. Well, fuck me. 
so that was the line. Somewhere between where I was and... I already went into town, right? I don't know how I would tell that. Somewhere between where I was and here was the difficulty spike. <laughs> I guess, yeah, the only thing I did in town was heal and talk to people. So if I'm not to go up, I shall go down. Um, did it take off my... I guess because I died, that makes sense. Oh, it auto-saved when I left that town. That's what it did. That, that's smarts. Oh, god, no. Alright, I think this was also the wrong direction. I love that I'm fighting four vampire girls and two killer mantises, though. Because that's hilarious. All right, no, you go this way. And okay, that configuration stayed on. Yeah, we're more suited to be over here, apparently. I didn't even realize I was think about I'm wearing my Final Fantasy shirt for a Final Fantasy game. All right, there's the level up that we got already. I can't go over the mountains. All right, and back to down here. I'm gonna say, for the time being, I don't know where I'm supposed to be. So, I'm gonna head, save, head back into town, heal up, you know, all that. And I'm gonna just say, that's gonna be the end of this episode. Uh, was I supposed to go to the end? That's four times the price of that other inn in that in the countryside. Which probably shouldn't be too surprising. Uh, what about? Oh yeah, that's right. Again. Ooh. Am I? Is that max skill, or is it just a really? surprising number to land on. Uh, oh yeah, that's right. Here's the mag white mag magic shop. Oh no. It, okay, that's both. Cool. I will certainly... I mean, yeah. Certainly take all of those. I don't know who's gonna get them yet, but um, yeah. So I guess I don't know where I'm supposed to go, which is concerning. Alright, what if I ask? I never steal from the rebels, you can be sure of that. My home was in Finn, too. Can't go home now that the Empire is occupying the city. Alright, cool, good for you. Alright, this is where I started. My name is Gordon. I was once a Prince of Kashun. Now I'm nothing but a coward. When my brother Scott fell in battle, I abandoned my kingdom and fled here. 
so you've asked to take up arms in the struggle? I'm so afraid Hilda will turn me away that I haven't even asked her. I'm installing here. Just to spy this coward. Yep, you right. Oh, this is the sanctuary to revive people. Alright. I'm... Yeah, I have no idea what else to do, so... Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed just the quick intro to Final Fantasy 2. Be sure to come back next time. As always, I will see you in the next episode. Bye-bye!